In Pakistan, electoral symbols are more than just pictures. They are crucial for voter recognition. This is important because over 40% of Pakistan's population is illiterate. Imagine a ballot paper filled with names and symbols. For many, these symbols are the only way to identify their preferred party or leader. With a plethora of parties and candidates, each one is assigned a unique symbol. For instance, Nawaz Sharif's party uses a tiger, while Bilawal Bhutto's party has an arrow. But ex-Prime Minister Imran Khan's Pakistan Tehreeke Insaf, also known as the PTI, has been stripped of its iconic cricket ball symbol. The reason? Here's where the controversy kick-started in Pakistan's electoral system. The election commissioner of Pakistan stripped off the PTI symbol on technical grounds. The election commissioner cited intra-party elections as a prerequisite for any party to take part in the vote. And this decision has thrown Imran Khan's party, PTI, into turmoil. With the loss of their symbol, PTI is facing a significant challenge. Each candidate now has to use different symbols, causing confusion among the voters. Not just that. This will also increase the campaign cost for Pakistan's PTI. And it does not stop there. Without a registered symbol, PTI candidates can't claim reserved seat in the National Assembly. This will highly impact the PTI candidates' parliamentary representation. If Nawaz Sharif is the election, then it is better to make a notification and make a notification of the election. This situation has set a complex stage for Pakistan's upcoming general elections on February 8th. The rejection of nomination papers for key PTI leaders have further intensified the debate. PTI spokesperson Hassan took to X saying nominations were rejected on fake and flimsy grounds. PTI senior leaders have said the party would challenge the rejections in the court. Critics suggest this may lead to a selection rather than an election. The future of democracy in Pakistan remains hanging in the balance ahead of the polls. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.